everybody, welcome back to the channel, finally for another video. I think that you guys are seeing this video after my sort of like update video, but this is the first like full video that I am posting since everything is fixed on YouTube. And what better way to do it than with a what I eat in a day. You guys have been asking for more of these types of videos. And since I am trying to be more conscious, 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 <laughs> about eating more regularly, um, especially during the day and right now with life as busy as it is. If you didn't see that video where I talked about like the problems I was having with making sure that I was eating enough, I will link it below. It was actually posted on my other channel during the whole like YouTube issue. But um, since I'm doing that, I decided to go ahead and post a what I eat in a day today as my first like official video back after that update. So for breakfast this morning, I'm starting early. I'm gonna make this short and sweet because I have not showered. I'm not even wearing a bra. Um, so this first clip is, you know, not gonna be super long, but I'm having coffee with some protein powder in it. So today I actually used um, my son's protein powder, which is a muscle milk vanilla, just because I'm out of collagen powder. So that is actually a gainer protein powder but you have to use like six scoops to make it a gainer and I only, or to get a serving and I put like half a scoop in it because I didn't want a ton of calories. I think the like six scoops is, um, I put a whole scoop. So six scoops is 650 calories. So I did one scoop, so that's about a hundred calories and about 25 grams of carbs. So not, I don't think that's terrible. And I just put it in my coffee. So I'm having a protein coffee for breakfast this morning. Um, and I guess I will see you guys as we go on throughout the day. We are for sure, I know having the Taco Bell quesadilla a uh, copycat recipe for dinner tonight. And a lot of people have been asking for that recipe as well or to see how I make that. So maybe I'll include that in here. But um, yeah, I will see you guys the next time that I eat. I am so glad to finally be making videos on this channel again. Like I've missed this channel because I feel like this channel is more of like me um, and like my life and my thoughts and my feelings and less of like mom. Hood. You know what I mean? Like this is the channel that I get to be more free to be myself on. And so I've definitely missed over the past like six weeks not filming for this channel. So I'll see you next time I eat. I'm going to drink my protein coffee that I've now reheated twice because it's the last week of school and yeah, go on about my day. I've got some cleaning to do. House is a mess. Already got sheets going. So yeah, see y'all in a bit. I'm dressed now and I'm ready to tackle my day. It's like 10 o'clock already now at this point, but I wanted to check in and say, in order to get more hydration all the time, I've been really loving these Liquid Death seltzer waters. They're like flavored seltzer water. This one is Convicted Melon and it is delicious, like so good. However, I just got my favorite ones in the um, mail from Amazon because I order them on Amazon. They're cheaper there. You can get like an eight pack for like 12 bucks versus like at a, grocery store or a gas station, they're like two to three dollars a piece. So definitely a better deal on Amazon. But these ones are the cherry obituary and that one is my favorite, but I didn't have any more of these this morning. Just got this shipment in, but that melon one is currently what I'm drinking right now to make sure that I go ahead and get my water in. And I did chug just a regular glass of water as well. I'm actually filming right now for my other channel. So I got a lot going on, but I wanted to check in and say, I'm getting my water in y'all. I learned my lesson on that. So see you in a bit when I eat lunch. I think I'm gonna have a salad for lunch today. So that should be really good. But see, literally every time I do a what I eat in a day video, I'm like, I'm gonna have something really great for lunch, really healthy. I'm gonna show everybody what I eat. But then I'm like, you know what? That's not real life. I don't always eat super healthy, super like in-depth lunches. So I'm gonna show you, here's, here's what I'm having for lunch today. It is a good old sandwich and a pickle day. And this is like the new Hawaiian roll bread or whatever that is so delicious. And these pickles are the Clausen pickles. And if you have not had these, y'all, you are missing out. These are the best pickles in life. I bought these Sunday and they're almost already gone. Me and Chris have been like inhaling them. And then same thing with these chips, these deep river snacks, the pink Himalayan salt and vinegar. I actually got these at Marshall's. They still have the Marshall's tag on them right there. Um, just to give them a shot. And again, I bought these yesterday and they're like half gone, but like everybody eating them. So I'm, that's what I'm having. I don't know that I'll actually eat it all and I will take a picture or I'll insert 
whatever. I'll come back on here and show you what I actually eat of it all. But yeah, this is my lunch today. This is real life and busy busyness, you know? This is what I'm having for lunch. It's food, at least I'm eating. I actually ate most of it today. Feeling pretty good about that. It's weird now that I'm like happy when I can eat. Isn't that weird? <laughs> anyway, that's what's left. Okay, so it's dinner time now. And I am cooking the copycat Taco Bell quesadillas. And I always forget to start the video like as I'm trying to make it because there's just so much going on. So I'm gonna try and show you guys like what I'm doing as I'm going. I do already have two of them going, but this is like the Taco Bell copycat chicken quesadilla recipe and it's really good and it's actually really close to how it tastes. So the first thing you need to do is just take a tortilla and spread some cream cheese on it. So that is what I'm doing right now. And then once you got a layer of cream cheese, you just sprinkle a little bit of cheese and then we're gonna top it with chicken. Now this chicken has, I've cooked it in the pan over here and this is just cooked with some cumin, paprika, and then you add the creamy chipotle sauce on it. So we're gonna top that, add a little bit more um, shredded cheese and then cook it like a quesadilla and that's it. It's that simple. And this is what it looks like when it's done. It looks a lot like a Taco Bell quesadilla and it tastes a lot like one too. So I have, I guess this is about one and a half tortillas and you know, that. So usually I eat two, but I am feeling a little bit hungry tonight. So I grabbed, or usually I eat two like pieces. Um, so I got three, but anyway, that's dinner. It's been several hours now. Um, I did eat actually most of my labs. <laughs> I guess I started talking and it got him wagging his tail. But anyway, I did eat most of that quesadilla. I think I left like a bite or two. And while I was eating it, I felt hungry and I like, you know, was going to eat the whole thing. And then I just was like, okay, usually that does not end up well. I eat a ton or not a ton. I eat more than normal. I think I'm hungry. And then it backfires and my stomach hurts later. And that is exactly what happened. Um, it is now 10 o'clock at night. I'm watching basketball, but um, my belly hurts. My stomach has been upset. I took Bryson to practice and my stomach was upset like the whole time I was there. And it's still like, I my stomach's are rumbling, rumbling, rumbling. Um, so I'm just kind of resting. I've been drinking a lot of water. I have a seltzer over here. I did eat my Italian ice, which is something that I eat every single night. And if you've been around, you know that. It's, it's pretty much since I started taking a GLP-1 or Manjaro Zip on, whatever you want to call it, I have been eating one of these every night. There are very few nights that I do not eat one of these. So these, I don't know why, like I've just been hooked on them for like, over a year and a half now. So that's all I'm going to eat today. Um, I don't think that it was the best eating day as far as like nutrition goes, but I don't necessarily think it was the worst either. I could have gone and gotten fast food and ate a large French fry, you know, baby steps. Um, I'm showing real life around here and real life is not always all the salads and, and everything. So that is what I ate today. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, let me know if you've ever tried that Taco Bell quesadilla copycat recipe and if you liked it we love it like we make it probably once every two weeks um it ends up on our menu because we just love it so much and it's easy and it's like i said much cheaper than going to taco bell so let me know if you've tried it or if you have not and want the recipe i will try to remember to link it below i am awful at doing that especially lately but yeah i'm feeling good i'm feeling good today i'm feeling n nourished and hydrated and all the things and school is over now and I can relax for the summer and lay at the pool on the days that I'm not nannying or filming and editing, which, you know, I can relax a little bit now that the kids aren't in school. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Max ran away from me over there. I hope that you enjoyed it and I will see you next week. Have a great day and a great weekend guys and a happy Memorial Day weekend. Um, have fun celebrating if you do. Um, remembering all those that have fallen for our great United States. And if you do celebrate, stay safe and happy and healthy. I'll see you guys next week. Bye.